just picked up the buddy guard from Sharpal. It's got a 325 grit coarse side and a 1200 grit extra fine side. Also is a uh, leather stroke sheath for some honing. On the front it says straight edge knives, axes, edge tools, and pointed tools such as a pick. Got monocrystalline diamonds, the leather strop, paracord, I believe it's uh, five feet of paracord. No oil needed. And here is this side for the leather. Designed and engineered in the USA. Uh, let's see, is there some German back here? Okay, it's made in China. Little, little bit of trickery there with the American flag. I thought it might have been made in the USA. So uh, I have a beat knife that is a work knife that's really took a beating. Got ran over with my semi truck. So let me get that. So here's my uh, K bar dozier. These are great, great cheap knives. I mean, there's these are about twenty dollars, maybe give or take on Amazon. Just a good cheap knife to have. Now, see the blade. Blade took a beating. It's uh, rolled over there, and it is actually really dull. I did put it through a two-in-one um, Smith sharpener, a real cheap four-dollar sharpener just to get a little bit of an edge back but it still needs a lot of work down at the bottom so I'm going to test this out and see if we can restore the blade but these are really great knives and hold up well you can see this is, it was caught in the tread of the tire and it did a few rotations I seen it actually kick out in the parking lot and then I went and picked it back up but I've had this knife for a few years it's a good knife. So let's uh, test this buddy guard out and see how it goes. There's the directions. Written pretty well in English. The directions are pretty good. Just showing you the pattern. And it's got some more information down at the bottom uh, for polishing. In the hand. The uh, leather feels really good actually, so good to see. Nice quality. So in about 60 seconds, I just cleaned this up real good. So at the plate, it's not really rolled over. Kind of like a little bit of a chunk's missing, but I do have it pretty sharp now, so definitely would recommend picking that up. And at the price, um, it does great. The coarse side will get you an edge back, and the smooth will get you sharp. I just did the paper test, and it is good. I'll slice right through.